Let's take a look at a question on the topic of trigonometric functions. Angles A and B are both obtuse and tangent A plus B equal to 3 over 4. Without the use of calculators, part 1 state the range of angle A plus B. Now let's take a look at the information we have there. We know that for obtuse angle, and we have angle A and B are both obtuse. So let me write down angle A must be between 90 to 180. Same as for angle B. So what happened here is that if I were to add this angle together, the lowest I can get will be 180. Okay, and the highest when I add these two values is going to be 360. So the quadrant from 180 to 360 is going to be at this quadrant 3 or quadrant number 4. Now, do remember that you are also given the second information where tangent A plus B equals to 3 over 4. That means that the tangent value of angle A plus B is positive. So, I need to fulfill this information and this information here. And since this information will give me the possible region will go to be quadrant 1 and quadrant number 3. And I have to pick a common region. So, tangent, tangent is going to be in quadrant number 3. So my answer for part 1, since quadrant number 3, so my value of A plus B must fall between 180 to 270. So that's for part 1. Let me erase and let's discuss part 2. Now let's take a look at part 2 of the question. Find the value of sine A plus B. And since we are given tangent A plus B, the value is 3 over 4. And from part 1, we already know that the triangle is in quadrant 3. So let me draw ASDC quadrant here. Now if you don't remember how to draw a triangle, let's just think of a bow tie over here. Okay, the shape of a bow tie. Now choose the triangle in quadrant 3. So this is the triangle in quadrant 3. Right angle. So if you know exactly how to draw, we are going to draw straight away using this one here. The base of the triangle must touch the x-axis. And this is the origin and draw a triangle. Right angle. This is the reference angle here. I'm going to place this one in. And tangent is going to be TOA opposite over adjacent. I'm going to place 3 at the opposite side, which is here. Adjacent. 4. Now do be a bit careful. This one is to the left. So this value here is a negative 4 and this one is coming down. So this value is a negative 3. Now let's find out what this side is by doing a Pythagoras. I'm going to do square root of negative 3 squared plus negative 4 squared. I'll get a value at 5. Let me write down 5 here. Next, I'm going to write down the value of sine A plus B now. So for this one here, we're taking SOH, so, so it's going to be opposite over hypotenuse. Opposite is going to be negative 3, hypotenuse is going to be 5, so answer will be negative 3 over 5. So that's all for this question here.